All right, here we go. So, two is one, one is none. If you've ever listened to any of the survivals, guys, they'll all tell you the same thing. Here we go. Nice little knife. This one is actually Guidesman Freebie. This one here, I found it in the parking lot at work. Uh, honestly, I couldn't tell you the name right offhand of what this one is. Uh, the reason I got it, uh, somebody had lost it in their, out of their pocket. It was snowing. I found it in the spring. This has bent up a little bit from the plow and somebody running over it, but still works pretty good. I just sharpened it up. Try to get some of the nicks out. This guy here is a Gerber. This one was given to me free. Just to replace the blades onto them. Thanks to Brock Withers. Great guy. This one is the second one I bought. Um, this one's actually got a better blade into it. But like I said, I bought this one. Two is one, one is none. I always carry these. This guy here, cheap, Stanley, multi-tool, but razor blade as well. This guy is always in my car. Center console. I need tools. I have tools. Not the greatest, but it works. Now, Always handy to have some of these little extra rings around. I actually got to go get some, throw them in my pack. Actually, I have some in my pack. This guy here, I'll show you this. Survival whistle right here. A little thing sticking out. It's got a fire strike on the inside. You got your little compass. Now this would be the third item in my backpack that has a compass. I have a survival knife and a survival shovel. This is one, like I said, a three with a compass. This is one of my fire strikes. Here's another. A little saw blade to get down the magnesium rod and you're supposed to be able to strike match off with, or spark off with that better done with a knife on this um, magnesium and fire strike to strike that off there can opener always have a can opener more than one source your multi-tool has that these guys go in my backpack. I've got uh, probably enough food for myself for a week, if not longer, if you're eating one meal a day. All right. I've got two set of cook pots out there. Um, and most of this stuff is actually just so I can take the girls out and we can do day adventures out on um, some family's property. Just go hang out. But you always carry multiples. Again, back to that, that two is one, one is none. Uh, just a quick video for you guys. Um, make sure when you're packing your car, you keep, keep this in mind. First aid kits, knives, um, always. Two is one, one is none. Then, you know, an extra thing of oil. Um jumper cables you know, make sure you're, you're uh, whenever you go out and fill up with gas say every second one or third one you're checking your tire pressure if you have easy access to that spare tire check the air pressure in the spare tire too this, guy's will, this, this will save you guys a lot of headache later on down the road you can swap out your tire. You don't have to call for a tow truck. And then when you roll back into town, take it over to the tire center. Get it done. No big deal. Save you 
probably an extra 20 minutes sitting on the roadside doing it yourself than you would waiting on the tow truck guy plus all the money that you would have to do to spend to get that done for you and then you'd still have to go take the tire and get it fixed once you got back into town so just something to think about guys be safe take care